swing containers. So in Java, a component is the basic user interface object. And all Java applications include a component. Components include lists, buttons, panels, windows. So in order to use components, you need to place them in a container. So a container is a component that holds and manages other components. So for creating a GUI, I do not say GUI, <laughs> we need at least one container object, right? So there are three types of containers. The panel. The panel provides space to use an organized component such as buttons and labels. The panel does not contain a title bar, menu bar, or border. Generally, panels are used in the frame. Frame is a top-level window with a title and a border. And dialog is like a pop-up window that pops out when a message has to be displayed. JLabel, JText field, JButton. So guess what? In this section, we're going to learn some basic components of Swing. JLabel is a class of Java Swing, and it's used to display a single line of read-only text. The text can be changed by an application, but a user cannot edit it directly. JText field is a class of Java Swing, and it's a text component that allows the editing of a single line of text. And the J button is a class of Java Swing. It's used to create a labeled button. So when the button is pushed, some actions are performed, you know, for example, save, update, delete, etc. 